She was taking, she was taking from her family. She was taking from me. She was taking from her grandkids. You know, she, she didn't deserve that. It's been more than three decades since Anita Shell was killed in Little Rock. Her daughter, only three months old at the time. Tonight, our Haven Hughes sits down with Erica Brown Killian, a daughter refusing to give up her hope in her mother's case. I just want answers. 34 years is a long time to go after justice or to get a resolution of what happened to my mother. In January of 1989, her mother Anita Shell was brutally murdered. I just want to not only get justice for my mother, but I also want other people to know that this is what a product of all of the murders and all of the killings look like. The case file shows Shell's throat was cut and she was left for dead in East Little Rock. She didn't deserve to die like that. As the years went by, Brown Killian and took matters into her own hands. I ended up subpoenaing the case file and trying to go through it, pages of the case file myself. Noticing a few things. It was a lot of different things that jumped out to me. There were people that skipped town. There were, you know, people that told different stories at the time to the police. There were, um, of course, there was blood left. But the case still remains cold something she questions with 21st century technology. I think that it's come far enough. At that time, DNA evidence didn't exist. So with DNA and things like that being present now, I believe that the cold case could be solved. She says if resources we have now could be used, she believes her family could get answers and she could get closure. It's been years, just forget it, but it's my mother. And if her mother could see her fighting. It began to rain and, um, I just feel like some of those are her tears and it's just happy, you know, it's just like, go get them, don't give up, you know, don't go get them, don't give up, you can do it, it's never too late. That was our Haven Hughes reporting. If you or your loved ones have any information that could help identify uh, Brown Killian's mother's killer, contact the Little Rock Police Department as soon as possible. She wants the case reopened and would like to see it solved in the new year.